Hello, it's Living the Good Life, and this is my 300th episode. And so I wanted to bring you something that I loved and that I think that some of you have grown to love as well, and that is a purchase of RS Prussia. So um, a friend contacted me and said, hey, isn't this your china? I saw it on Marketplace. And so it was the cups, the syrup pitcher without the underplate, and the uh, cracker jar. I said, yes, yes it is. And she said, okay, I'll get it for you because I was out of town. And it was $40. So she runs up and gets it. And, she, and we found out that the woman had purchased it at a family, either estate sale or garage sale. Everything you're seeing for $30. So she'd already made 10 and she was decided to keep the tankard. And then about two days after I got home, um... I looked online and she'd put the tankard up for sale. So again, my friend went up and got it for me because um, uh, I couldn't get up there and it was $40. So I have spent $80 on everything you're seeing and they are marked. Well, this one isn't. I think maybe that one is. I think they're not marked is what I should say. So here is, maybe this one shows a little better. So here is this lovely cup. This is the stipple mold, and you can see that it's kind of dot, dot, dot around the edge. It's called the stipple mold with a yellow rose decor, no marks. Here are the cups, uh, the saucers to the cups, and you can see that some of them have a red flower, pinkish flower. Some of them have this yellow rose, but they are all together. And one other thing, um, and this, these would have went with a coffee pop, uh, no, this, yeah, I don't know, coffee or tea, either one. Uh, but there would have been a pot that went with these, and uh, I don't have that. And I only have five cups and saucers instead of six. So they would either come with four or six, but never five. So one has had an oops along the way. But oh, aren't these pretty? Look at the little gold decor inside. So there are five of those. They're all the same. Okay. Then there's this cracker jar. Oh, it's a beautiful one. Look at that. Look at that decor. These are called shadow flowers, that little whitish mark. So they're shadow flowers. Also with the stipple mold, here's the lid, not marked with this little pointy finial. I can turn it around and show you the other side as well. It doesn't have quite as much decor. So it's just got a couple of roses on that side as we move around. That's so pretty. And on this side, most people would think, oh, it's it's a creamer. Well, it's not because it has a lid. Uh, has a, lid. a creamer wouldn't have a lid. This is a syrup pitcher. It would have an underplate very similar to these saucers, but we don't have that. Here is the other side of it, again with the yellow rose. Okay, So those were 40. And then the tankard, is 40 so here's all the roses and you can really see that stippling up here see how the, it's all kind of it reminds you of that moriaji that Japan had and they were making it about the same time as this but I much prefer Prussia than I do anything that's uh, Japanese and there's just one flower and some rosebuds on this side and I don't think it's marked either nope no mark so, I hope you enjoyed seeing everything. That, well, that was uh, $40, so $80 for everything you're seeing here today. And um, I've very much enjoyed these 300 episodes and sharing all my finds with you all. I hope you continue to enjoy what I find as well. And I have had a fabulous week this week finding all kinds of vintage items and some antiques. And I'm looking forward to showing those to you too. So there'll be another video in probably a couple of days. If you like this type of thing, I'd really enjoy your subscription and getting a comment from you. Take care. Bye-bye.